Autumn had arrived on the island of Sodor. The leaves were changing from green to brown. As Thomas puffed along, he heard the chug, chug, chug of a tractor at work close by. Hello, said Thomas to the tractor. I'm Thomas. Hello, said the tractor. My name's Terence. I'm ploughing. What ugly wheels you've got, said Thomas. They're not ugly. They're called caterpillars, said Terence. I can go anywhere. I don't need rails. I don't want to go just anywhere. I like my rails, thank you very much. Winter came, and with it, dark, heavy clouds full of snow. A snowplow was fixed to Thomas, but it was heavy and uncomfortable. He shook it and banged it until it was so dented that eventually it had to be taken off. The next morning, the driver and fireman worked hard to mend the snowplow, but they couldn't make it fit properly, so Thomas had to set out without it. I don't need that stupid old thing, he said to himself. Snow is silly soft stuff. It won't stop me. But as he rode along, the snow kept making his wheels spin, and he found it quite a struggle. Silly soft stuff, silly soft stuff, puffed Thomas. Stupid old snow, said Thomas, and he rushed into a tunnel. At the other end, he saw a heap of snow had fallen from the sides of the cutting. Cinders and ashes, I'm stuck! And he was. The driver and fireman tried to dig the snow away from Thomas, but as fast as they dug, more snow slipped down. Oh, my wheels and coupling rods, said Thomas sadly. I shall have to stay here till I'm frozen. And he began to cry. Just then, who should come chugging along but Terence the tractor? I heard you were in trouble, said Terence, so I've come to help. First, Terence pulled Annie and Clarabel away from the snowdrift. Thank you, Terence. Thank you, Terence, they said. They were very relieved to be free of the snow. Next, Terence came back for Thomas. He pulled and pulled. And eventually, with the most enormous effort, he dragged Thomas clear of the snow and into the tunnel. Thomas was very grateful. Thank you, Terence, he said. I think your caterpillars are splendid. I'm sorry I was so rude to you before. Terence returned to his farm while Thomas puffed tiredly back to the engine shaft. 